Thank you very much, Holly, and good that you've joined us. You ran over here graciously because you're nice and fit now. And welcome, Terry. Great to have you on the show, Terry. We've reached the end of our 12-week Jets Fitness Summer Challenge, and we've gotten to know each other quite well over that time. So it's good that you managed to come in here today and tell everybody that I actually was quite good at this Jets Fitness Challenge, wasn't I? You were awesome, actually. Thank yeah, you. you. did really well. Nice. All right. No, no, no. A bit more. How's he actually <laughs> done? Like, it's been 12 weeks. You've got to know him well. He started off slow. And then um, as we got going, he um, definitely um, improved and showed, showed a lot. So Yeah, and, and the one thing too is it was a, an interesting time of year because we were just yeah. getting into Christmas. So there was lots going on and mm. lots of habits that needed to be broken. So considering it was that time period, you had to teach me a lot, didn't you? Yes, yes. And I think in, in that initial stage, we were just more focusing on what do you value and how can we introduce the active lifestyle to your busy lifestyle, so. Yeah. yeah. What do you think the biggest changes were for you doing the challenge? I think just that mental shift for me. Yep. Um, you know, once I realized that making it part of my lifestyle was easier than I thought, mm -hmm. then it just becomes part of your lifestyle. Because you know how you find excuses? People find excuses, don't they, Terry? I've got you know, so many. Too busy, I oh, ran out of time, did yep. this. But I got to the point where I started feeling guilty that I wasn't. At I the know, gym. me too, if I missed a class or something, absolutely. Mm -hmm. and, um, and what about you in terms of, did you get extra energy? I felt like I had more energy and I was, you know? Yeah, definitely. And you know, there were little things like just sometimes mixing it up at a Jets, Terry would take me for some boxing. Yeah. And, uh, you know. Showed, showed, showed some pretty good power as well. So. Yeah, yeah, and a, yeah. and a lack of coordination at the start. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but see, look, there, there I am now, you know. Oh, you look like yeah. a pro move over Muhammad Ali there, yeah. And that was a good thing, you know. Sometimes you'd go into Jets and um, Terry would have a little bit of spare time and he'd say, oh, come on, let's try this. So we did all those sorts of things and I felt good about it. I noticed that people were telling me my face structure had changed. Mm. So, you know, overall, quite good. We, I lost a bit of body fat. And, yes, you did. Yes, yes, yes you did. You dropped um, about 6%, which yeah. was really good. Uh, good lost some uh, centimetres around the waist, and it was really good for our last assessment. So you did really well. Thank you. Now, well done, you. That's Thank awesome. You. Unfortunately, Steve, my trainer's not here, so um, we can't give any results. I just said I did amazing, right? Yeah, I, I spoke to Steve, actually. Oh, no. oh yeah, good, <laughs> good. <laughs> yeah, so we had, we had a, a good catch-up, and um, the biggest thing he mentioned is you love the boxing side. Yeah. And, that, that's the most important part is finding something that you really love. So yeah, the, the boxing did really well. And I did. Oh, look, there's it. me boxing on screen right now. I'm the one like really holding, sucking in the old um, the old breath there. I absolutely love the boxing. That's just something that um, I really enjoyed. I think the key for me was the, um, there's all sorts in that boxing class. And it also meant that um, I knew on a Monday and a Wednesday, that's where I was going at five o'clock. I was there. And at the end of it, I probably couldn't walk in my car, to my car. Oh, good sign. Or grip the steering wheel. <laughs> yeah. But I felt really good from it. Um, also, um, the other thing I loved, not just um, the boxing class, but actually being in the gym mm. was really fun because it's such a, a, a bunch of, uh, you know, eclectic mix of people. As you say, it's for all types, yes, right? Yes. Um, and, um, and they've got free Wi-Fi, so I could just plug in and get my podcast. You're right about the Wi-Fi. And, and Terry, you know, what do you think is the hardest thing for people that want to start an active lifestyle and are thinking of joining the gym? What do you think the first step they need to do? Um, first step is actually go into um, one of the branches and join up. And the good thing about once you've done that is then you're given the support from the staff there to actually guide you towards what needs to be achieved. So if you're unsure how to you know, find the values or how to set goals, mm -hmm. we do have um, you know, staff there from Accelerate PT to also help as well and yeah. Okay. <laughs> yep, that's me after a boxing session. Yeah. All right. It's week 12. <laughs> one, one thing, just one thing. If you join the gym, what should you do? Go. Go. <laughs> Don't just waste go, that yeah, money. Just get Don't started. waste that money. Just, just get started. Get in there. Um, give it a go. You'll, you'll find out um, as you're starting um, what direction that you want to head in with your goals. And it, that's all it takes. Just get in there. Create that habit. Now, everyone's like-minded at a jet, so you have a yep. good time. Yep. Yeah, good work. Thanks, Terry. <laughs>